Hello everybody, welcome to Castle's Corner. This is going to be another do-it-yourself series. Uh, now this video has been requested by a few people, but also I needed it for myself because uh, I needed it. So I went online and I was looking up different ways to assist you with uh, middle front splits, whatever you want to call them, basically where your legs are open all the way up and you're doing a very impressive looking split. Now this typically takes many months to achieve, etc, etc, but it shouldn't need to take that long. So they have certain machines online to help you kind of get through the process faster, but they were all very expensive. So you know me, I don't like that. A lot of people want to be able to do a split. They want to be able to do it easy, conveniently, without a lot of money being spent on it. So I'm going to show you today how to build, well, what I call anyways, the, the Leg Splitter 3000. It just helps you open up your legs, costs almost no money. You need almost no materials. So why don't you come in here and I'll show you what it looks like here. So we're gonna be building it now. All you need is two pieces of wood. I just had some leftover scrap uh, two by four, so I got these guys. Uh, some padding, you're gonna need a ratchet strap, the kind that uh, makes this noise. You all know that one. You're gonna need a couple screws, a drill bit, an eye hole, and something to anchor it to the wall, and then just two L brackets, braces, bookshelf, something that looks along these lines. Now just, uh, I'll go ahead and get into the build, but it's, it's really quite simple, and then I'll be demonstrating how to use it as well, just like always, everybody. finished building the seat. Now just a reminder, you don't actually have to use this. You can use anything like this, something similar. Then you're going to have your ratchet strap here. I had to cut about uh, four feet off this one. This was a 10 foot ratchet strap. I cut a good chunk off it. Then you're going to take this, feed it through the wall here where I put the attachment. It's going to take it, feed it through, wrap it around like so. The second end, you're going to connect to your bench, it just looks like that, and then you just get on in. <laughs> and then once you're in, you get to your whatever your normal split would be. For me, this is my very poor range of mobility, this is my normal split. I'm just going to ratchet myself in until I'm on the wall, and then once I'm on the wall, as you can see, my pelvis is being forced to be flat. When you're trying to do a middle split, it's very important that your pelvis be at this angle so your legs are actually able to go outside into a middle split position. And all you're going to do every so often when you feel comfortable again, you ratchet it one more. It starts to feel a little stressful, a little strain. Breathe into it with your stomach to stay relaxed. Keep breathing with your stomach. Give it a minute or two. Ratchet yourself in again, breathe with your stomach, give it a minute or two. Ah, feels good. And just keep doing that all the way till you get into the wall. Once you're at the wall, you'll be able to do a standard old regular middle split, guys. So that's it. I hope this helps and uh, have fun making your own.